Hey guys, Synergy here and I'm bringing you a brand new video. This one's on the EVA 8 shotgun and we're going to get into this gameplay now guys. Um, basically, as you see here, we're just on the loading screen so I'm going to talk you through how to rack up those kills and the easiest methods into getting your shotgun kills. So you've got the shotgun kills as a basic challenge. Um, it's not exactly hard to get these kills guys, it's just being smart about it. Um, one of the main tips that I will let you know is basically what you don't want to do is you don't want to be sat in a corner just waiting for somebody to run past you. That's one of the biggest mistakes. If you're trying to rack up those kills you need to be head first into the action. So yeah, I'm going to show you an example of it. This is going to be part one of three guys. So I'm going to be uploading three different videos of the EV8 shotgun just to show you that I do know what I'm talking about and that my tactics do work effectively for you. So feel free after you watch this video, go try it out, see how much you can basically dominate with the shotgun as well. Now don't be afraid of using a shotgun at range because this one is quite overpowered as well. Um, you can basically take people out at two shots at range, one shot close range, stuff like that. I always take the two shots just to make sure that I get the kill because sometimes you can get hit markers with this weapon guys. Right, so as you see here, I'm just going to climb up onto this wall, jump over here, a little bit of wall gliding. But I'm actually going to go from the bottom side rather than the top side, guys, because you'll find most of the rushes, as you're going to see here, there you go. They're going to come through that doorway in specific. Sorry about the little bit of lag there, guys. Right, so... You're going to see me basically take out Captain Vaughn there, and this is the mistake I make. I turn around, and here we go. There you go. Mistake number one. Right, don't worry, guys. It does get a lot better than that. Just a bit of a sketchy start for you. As you can see, this guy here. There you go. Nice and easy kill. Okay, he wasn't looking at me, and that's exactly the same mistake I made. As I'm wall gliding there, we take out another guy. So one, two, and there you go. We take out number three. We see it on our left guy running across there you go number four okay so there's four kills consecutively in the middle of domination because you know the guys are going to be rushing that way i knew this guy was going for c um, you want to pay attention to your minimap as well guys that's going to help you out a hell of a lot see me take out those grunts there but what you're going to see is me back up on myself because i've seen that red dot on the minimap and there you go we pick up well, it was an assist on that one, so yeah, we can't claim the kill on that one. You see that guy just run through that doorway? And another one there. There you go. Kill number one. Okay. Uh, where's the other guy? We're just going to back into this corner because we know he's behind us. There you go. Kill number two. Not behind us, actually below us on that one. Okay. Nice easy kill. You can see this guy here. Now I'm going to use a different tactic. I'm actually going to make it hard for him to hit me by just jumping against the wall. And we pick up yet another kill there, guys. So we see this guy running underneath. Unfortunately, he turns there. And as I hit marker him, I don't take him out. He actually takes me out. So that's my second death. We're currently on eight for two, guys. Like I said, this is part one of the tutorial. So... You'll need to watch all three videos if you want to know all about it, but um, if you feel that you're confident after the first video of knowing what you're doing and stuff like that, by all means you can use it. You don't want to challenge people when they get the edge on you and stuff like that, as you can see he did at the front of me. I'm just going to jump down, take that kid out there, and there you go, we take him out. And we've got just got another kill there, but he actually took me out. I'm going to use the full rank card and bring in my titan. As soon as it's up, uh, it's already up, so I had no reason to use that at burn card whatsoever. So yeah, I've just wasted a burn card, guys. You don't want to do that. Right. So you can see it's neutralizing at the minute, but what I'm refraining from doing is going in between that middle circle. You do not want to do that as much as possible. The reason being is solely because you're going to get grenaded, satchel charges, arc grenades, everything will be thrown at you at the same time. So I'm currently in the Titan at the moment. This is just a bit of security because I just want to hold this flag at the minute. And obviously, I want to get a good gameplay going, so I'm just going to rack up the kills now. You can see that the shotgun tactic does work, guys, and it's a nice, easy thing to do for you. Um, the main tips of using the shotgun is you have to get close range. What you can do to that is you can use your wall gliding, look at your minimap, 
pick your wall glides wisely and you'll pick up those kills regardless no matter what okay so don't forget to leave a like on here don't forget to share the video if you do like the video by all means um, just let people know about it it might help them as well and yeah we're just gonna enjoy a bit of gameplay for a bit in the titan so as you can see i'm actually just taking out a lot of the grunts because i actually wanted to level up as fast as i could i got me whole level in the day and you can see the guy just in the middle there we end up getting an assist because that guy i actually saw this green um arrow on there which is one of our players and i was wondering how the hell he's got a green arrow um that's another thing i actually wanted to point out so if anybody knows that i'm quite interested to know not that it's uh, anything important it just looks kind of cool and i'm quite jealous <laughs> Right, so yeah, I threw my rocket salvo in there because I knew that Titan was going to come back out anyway. So I thought, yeah, whatever damage that takes. You can see them actually taking A at the minute. So I'm just going to put the damage on that Auto Titan because I know he's ejected from that Auto Titan. And yeah, we're going to get as much damage as we can on him. So chances are, whoever's in there, they're going to come back for the Titan. There you go, you can see him shooting at me in the window, he's pretty damn annoyed. And we pick up a nice easy kill there for you. Okay, I know this is shotgun tutorial guys, um, you could see it throughout the beginning, but I didn't want to just leave it just solely into the shotgun gameplay. That will also come in the different parts as well to this uh, sort of tutorial. So you're actually going to see the shotgun on three different gameplays, three different maps, different game types, stuff like that. You can see that guy just underneath me, I'm going to take him out, that's a free kill for me. If you're going to run at a Titan, at least make sure you can't be seen. <laughs> okay, so basically once you've got B and C on this map, what you can do is you can actually, I do apologise for the sticking, you can actually um, just basically box them in this air spawn, because they're going to be spawning all the way around here. And if you've got a Titan, you've basically got aim on everything, so you're going to pick up most of those kills. You can see I actually missed that one there, I should have got that one. And unfortunately, it does lag a bit in this one, guys. My new computer comes on Monday, so it's going to be a lot smoother for you. Just forked out quite a lot of money for that as well. There you go, take out number three, four, do, 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 do. And um, we're just recapping B as well. I never even realised that they started capping that one. That uh, was just a bit of laziness through me as well. Two out of three ain't bad, my friend, but let's go for three. Alright. Take out that grunt who was just stamping on what it seemed to be the bridge. You can see that human player there. There you go. Nice easy little kill. Damage and roll on my three safety protocols disabled. Charlie is under attack. All personnel should begin evacuation procedures. Right, so all I'm doing here is I'm just obviously pushing into C, seeing if I can pick up some random kills there. You end up getting a burn card, I presume it's some shot a grunt or something like that. I actually see like a little light under there and I think somebody was coming there, but yeah, it didn't seem that way. So I'm just backing off here and we find a Titan here. So we're just going to, again, add the damage onto the Titans. This can also help you with your Titan kills. If you see auto titans, they're basically free kills for all you guys. So you can just basically stand there, shoot them, take them out. That'll count towards your 40mm cannon uh, challenge as well that you get in the same rank as well. Right, so I'm just going to shut up for a minute because I'm pretty sure you're tired of listening to my voice. And I'm going to let you enjoy this video. There you go, my titan's been taken out. So I've just took as much damage as I can. You can see I got him into the doom mode as well. I wasn't going to let him have his titan up because I've got the shotgun and shotgun against the titan. There you go, and we pick up another kill from him disembarking that one. And we pick up yet another kill. So as you can see, these uh, shotgun kills, they're just racking up and up and up. 
and it's not exactly hard to get them guys as long as you get close range chances are you're gonna get the kill over somebody even with an assault rifle just spraying yeah to be honest because you've got a what do you call it a two shot kill they've got to spray at least half a clip there you go but it's one of those you want to pick your movement wisely as well you don't want to go willy-nilly just running in the open on roads because you're gonna get picked off you've got a shotgun you can see my score there, 21 for free. And there's the victory, so let's see how many kills we can rack up onto that 21, guys. If any. Right, so we are at the end of the gameplay, guys. You can see on the minimap there, somebody just shot the Titan. Bit of a stupid move, to be honest, and I don't even know why I didn't go for him. There he is. There you go, we'll pick up that kill, so 22. Unfortunately, this is where my Elgato did lag a little bit. Just taking out some random grunts. I don't even know why. I think it's because I'm bored trying to find the humans. <laughs> but we end up getting some challenges at the end of the game. So yeah, take out those grunts. Take out those spectres. Because chances are you're going to complete challenges. Which will add to your XP. 21 for free gameplay guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment the videos, guys. Um, every little helps. If you share my video, great, fine. Um, yeah, I do appreciate everything. I've been I've getting a lot of feedback recently, and what I've done is I've actually replied to everybody that has left me comments. So I am one to interact with you guys, so don't be shy. I'm not going to flame you. I'm not going to make you sound stupid. Even if it is a stupid question, I'll just say is that the correct meaning that you wish and yeah that's it peace out guys